Alright, this is one more days, and I'm back again with the Resident Evil 2 Let's Play. We left the, uh, the Tyke here. And she takes absolutely fucking forever to do anything. And I'm not actually sure she'll put you in the boxes. Oh, she will. Wunderbar. Although I think that should be actually be Wunderbar. I almost didn't do another one today, because I'm feeling so incredibly tired. I decided I was going to go to sleep at 11.30 for to get ready for work, which is a little late. And then I promptly didn't get to sleep until 3.30 in the morning, and I had to get up at 6.30. Yeah, my boss was not too pleased with my uh, status throughout the day. And I was freaking tired, so I don't remember anything I've done all day at any point ever. Oh, come on, get up there! Jesus Christ, at 12, I was a hell of a lot more self-sufficient than you are. Oh, they have different in animations for when she gets up. Sometimes she only does it in, uh, in one, sometimes it takes a little longer. That's there's something done in there to, uh, increase the, uh, the atmosphere of the game reality. Help get rid of your, uh, or help you, uh, suspend your old, the old disbelief there. Is there anything else here? Now we're gonna take that fun chance and run past the, uh, the zombies out there. See if we can pick up any extra items for Claire, like some, you know, health or ammo. So yeah, you'll notice that it's a lot easier to evade other characters as uh, Sherry due to her small size. I managed to uh, pretty well avoid everything there, despite the fact that that third zombie. Oh, there we go. I knew there was something in here. Sealed firmly. And uh, seeing as as long as Sherry doesn't die, I'll be okay here. I'm led to believe, by logic, if nothing else. Yeah, see, you might have jumped for me, but it didn't work. Very well. But Sherry can't take as many hits as any of the other characters. And I think she also moves a little slower. She's, uh, in terms of running speed, which makes sense, because she's 12. Claire! Are you there? Sherry, are you okay? Did you find your dad? She doesn't sound like Yes, she's I'm okay! Her. But I couldn't find him! Just but I did find something else for you! Here! I think it'd be a lot funnier if she failed. Here's another! Are you gonna give me the map? How about that Thanks, map? Thanks, sweetie. Now, why don't you come over here? I want you to stay with me. She sounds so reassuring. Claire! I can't reach the ventilation hole anymore! But don't worry, I'll find another way. Yes, all of the zombies have I can have take care of myself! So I guess that's a pretty good sign. Wait, Sherry, come back! Sherry! Sherry! Do you read me, Claire? We now have access to the back of the parking lot. <laughs> Got it. Very I'm getting out of here and heading to the sewer. Can you meet me there? I'm on my way. Oh, right, I don't know where that is. So let's take this crap that's here. Apparently the player doesn't want to pick it up. There she goes. Good on ya. Alright, so while we're at it, we're gonna go and check out the rest of the first floor. There's a a room that I'm not overwhelmingly excited about investigating because there's a lot of zombies in it. But it will help me use this key here a little more effectively. I'm gonna trade up. So that, that'll help me have a little bit more fighting power here. I'm not trying to do a speed run here, mostly because I don't remember the game well enough to do one of those. This is just me playing through this game. I haven't played. Oh, hello. Almost got it. Oh, almost. Apparently, dogs take a little rec longer to recognize char your character. 
compared to other enemies. I think we can act, uh, investigate the old autopsy room here. It's a spade key regardless of the fact that it doesn't say the spade key because I didn't check it. That door is taking a really long time to open. I don't know if this is slow down or if it's just intended to creep me out. No, it's just slow down. Oh, hello! Oh. Man. Right, I don't think Claire takes quite as many hits as Leon does very well. Anything in here? I'm gonna need that, I think. Oh, right, this will let me get the side pack, which will be an, an incredibly useful item in a very short period of time. Actually, it's just useful all the time, unless you carry more crap. So, let's just quickly do that. And in the army, armory there, there'll probably be some grenade rounds. So I'll be, uh, stock up on the old grenade launcher. In the Resident Evil remake... Where's the power already on, maybe? Because it sounds pretty on to me. In the Resident Evil remake, you, uh, Jill gets the grenade launcher. Chris does not. Oh, no, I do have to turn it off. And, uh, Jill, you can use a quick trick to get, uh, 260 shots, or 255, I think is what it is, of uh, any ammo that you happen to have equipped to it. So, when I first played Resident Evil 1. Come on, what's with all the slowdown today? Uh, there you go. It's all, all that does is, as far as I can figure. Is there anything else we're taking in here? Oh, yeah, right. I definitely want that. I don't know what that is. I kind of want to know. It sort of resembles the, uh... I don't know why, they, well, maybe it doesn't resemble it at all, but it makes me think of the, the gun, the ammo creation thing in Resident Evil 3. Alright, we're going to use the old car key. Now that we some more stuff. There we go, look at that. Bullets. More bullets. Bullets. Bullet. Not bullets. Bullets are sand sharks. And they're a serious issue. I'm pretty sure I can just pack this right in there. that long to put on an extra belt. And look at that. Two extra item slots. And I say that that's more useful taking Claire's game, or whoever's second, because the submachine gun is wicked to deal with that, uh, the mutant there. And the side pack helps you in this level, or in this game, where you don't get quite as much, uh, you know, ammo. And you can store more healing items in it. Makes me think of the, the hall in Resident Evil 1 where the dog breaks through the window. At least in the remake. Alright. Let's have some fun. Me and my grenade launcher are gonna have some, uh, some dealings. I don't know what is with that slowdown today. First we're gonna use the grenade rounds because I'm pretty sure the acid rounds are better against organic enemies, I think it is.
Plus you can carry a couple more guns with you with this side pack. I'm led to believe there's probably one of the Jagger, or, sorry, not Jagger, Jaguar. You can tell I'm tired because of the way I talk. I start using words that don't sound right. Uh, and this is the end of this first video. Go check the next one and uh, you'll pick me up right here. We'll see if Hooker Zombie's, uh, excuse me, still around.